Lock End is situated in one of the most deprived areas in the country and that's something that really drives our ambition to have high aspirations for all of our young people, even when they might not have those aspirations for themselves. So using courses on the SCQS has been really helpful because it's allowed us to help them determine what career areas they might be interested in in the future. Before the SCQF I would say we had a very traditional pathway through school in terms of the curriculum and qualification system in Scotland. We offered a range of National 5 higher courses, um, National 4s and National 3s. In 2017-18 we started to really notice that that traditional pathway that we'd been on for a long time wasn't meeting the needs of all young people in the school and we really had this aspiration to build a curriculum to cater for people who weren't on that more traditional pathway. It was really important for us to allow our young people to have the ability to study a mixture of qualifications, both academic and vocational. I suppose a big part of our success in terms of positive destinations has been building a really strong team within the school. Having Craig here as our employability officer and him not being a teacher has really benefited the process. Um, he's able to build a much different relationship with the young people than uh, the teaching staff do. Everything we do is underpinned by the government policy for career education standards because ultimately everything that's in that gears towards young people leaving school into a positive destination. So in school we offer a range of SEQF qualifications. We make sure that every young person leaving the school gets one-to-one -one support based on what they are career aspirations are, so basically we try and find a way for young people to have as many different options as possible. Also, every month, uh, myself and partners get around the table and discuss every young person in detail, making sure that we're putting in place appropriate supports where needed. It was really important for us to take into consideration the context that we are working in. Um, we don't have a massive number of young people that will go on to higher education at university, so the requirement for five hires was less important for us, although still an important pathway for us to maintain. Some of our young people are disengaged in mainstream secondary education, so I also run an alternative education programme where we try, where possible, to bring in some of our partners and deliver a, a range of courses or a course that aligns to their career aspirations. We have two main courses specifically, childcare and construction, that are both SUQF level qualifications. Uh, young people come off timetable a couple of afternoons a week or a day a week to take part in that and that's really about trying to find an alternative way to engage in, in education. That's one of the things that's really made sure that those young people that are at risk of becoming unemployed haven't been becoming unemployed over the last few years. This year is the first year that we've run a full option of SEQF courses and virtually every department we've got something that's considered to be less traditional and I think the buzz that's come from that has been really positive. The young people have been really engaged in their learning, they've enjoyed the continuous assessment aspect, they've been able to take ownership of most of the qualifications. Yeah, it is far more comfortable than sitting down and writing stuff all the time. It's good to get up and try to kind of get out your comfort zone with new things. It has helped me so much with communication as well. It's overall just inspiring and it puts you in a good mindset and it shows you that there are many careers that you never knew that existed before. We've partnered with organisations that the courses then can lead directly to, to positive destinations after school. And to give an example of that, last year when we run level four and five construction in school, five young people left school and went on to an employability programme and all five of those young people are now in modern apprenticeships. So if we're going to talk about how SEQF impacts uh, positive destinations, that is the perfect learner pathway. When in school, taking part in SEQF level qualification, they leave school, they go into an employability programme that, that is directly linked to the SEQF qualification and then eventually into a job, so for us that is that's the dream. One of the main motivations for us in joining the SEQF partnership programme was really to sort of raise awareness of the qualification framework. We had already kind of investigated on our own the different qualifications that are part of the SCQF, such as NPAs, Skills for Work and awards, and we were already putting in place plans to start and deliver them, but we really wanted to sort of try and raise awareness amongst the young people and their families and the community about the real value that can be found in those qualifications. 
Embedding DYW in school life at Lock End benefits young people because it gives us an opportunity to, to link their learning and embedding the curriculum. There are strong links between education and the world of work. A lot of the partner organisations that we work with that help deliver these qualifications are also in, in the world of work in, in these industries. So uh, if our young people are, are moving on from school into one of these industries, then they have somebody that they know, i.e. a mentor, somebody they can go to, uh, somebody they can phone or talk to when they need help. Uh, so we're not just trying to benefit them when they're in school, we're also trying to make sure we're benefiting them w when they leave. The challenge for us being a small establishment was really to try to find the best way to provide as much variety as possible. In order to achieve that, we decided to organise our entire senior phase by level. So pupils in S4 to 6 can choose from across the range of qualifications. This really helped us achieve our goal because we were able to have fuller classes, we were able to offer more variety, we were able to offer a wider range of qualifications across all departments. Being a small school it can be challenging because your staffing of course is, is small so this seemed to be the best way for us to get the best out of the curriculum and the young people and the staff. And it's allowed us to enable them to study in those areas of strength and interest throughout the senior phase which has allowed us to keep more pupils in school for longer and we know that when we do that we can get them a better level of qualification at the end which then leads on to a more sustainable and positive destination. The SCQF has helped me understand uh, the different levels they offer outside of the usual hires and National Fives. I want to be a nursery teacher when I'm older so in fourth year I've done a level four in childcare in fifth year, I've done a level five, and this year I'm doing a higher at City College. Uh, the courses have helped me by giving me a lot more confidence and definitely is going to help me for when I leave school and going into college. I think it's worth emphasising that last year, uh, every single one of our pupils who were leaving the school managed to move into a positive destination, so no young person was unemployed. I think we became the first school in Glasgow to achieve that, uh, and I think it's worth noting that the partnerships and the SQF qualifications that we are delivering and developed over the last few years has really contributed to that, to that success. Yeah, we would absolutely recommend being part of the SQF programme and also looking to offer that wider range of qualifications. I think the impact on our young people, even in just the one year that we've been running these courses fully, has been amazing. The SQF programme will help us to further kind of build that and get our young people to deliver that message across the school so that everybody is aware of the kind of benefits of studying these SEQF courses alongside the more traditional higher and national five qualifications. Mm -hmm.